Hey, my Mophie's and OPI. This is Mitrano Wyvernon. Oh, okay. Vandekem's just zooming in on my face. Okay. So, welcome to uh, Roblox. I f it's about time I finally got my um, new video. Okay, this is kind of disturbing. I don't like how it zooms in my face. But, hey, I gotta deal with that. Uh, but basically, face cam's back. Now, now there's some controversy to the... <sighs> I freaking died. I freaking died. Okay, so it just zoomed out. That's nice. So, it turns out whenever I uh, press any keys on the uh, Bandicam software, it basically uh, zooms out. Oh! I see what it's doing. If I look at it, it zooms in, but when I look away, look, when I look away, it usually will zoom out. <laughs> nah, the technology is stupid. Okay. Okay, there we go. Now it's actually zooming out. Okay, f perfect. But, uh, I promised that I would do antenna, but I'm still testing out the new codec. I thought... Okay, I'm probably going to give it one last chance. It's The fact that I'm on a new computer will probably make things different. So, well, hey, why not try this one more time and see if it's got any problems. Uh, right now, I currently do not have PowerDirector on this computer. So, I can't edit the video. So, I can't have my intro in it right now. So, you... That's why there was no intro in the uh, in this video because I don't have Power Director yet. Uh, it, I will be getting Power Director soon uh, back soon though. It's just uh, right now I'm just uh, talking to you guys about the new things of my new computer. And what I think about my new computer, I find the new computer uh, amazing. Like. Windows 10, a lot of people hate Windows 10, but I I personally uh, find Windows 10 a whole bunch of fun in my opinion. Hold on, I'm going to move this because this is too low. Okay, here we go. Uh, but basically, I find Windows 10 so much fun because... Oh, it's a witch platform. Okay. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Uh, Windows 10 is actually a, a really fun operating system. Lots of people hate it. it there's like major controversy on why um, it's uh, hated so much. But basically, uh, I find it a lot of fun. It, although it's kind of annoying every once in a while, but I can deal with it. I think it's just a bunch of crybabies or trolls who basically can't deal with that crap. Okay, uh... Now, it plays get uh, the performance on uh, Roblox is so much better. Uh, I will have to stipulate to that because, like, performance is like ten times better than it was on my laptop. Because, um, oh god, I didn't see the lava jumps. Uh, gosh, why am I always so word? Oh, it detects motion. Okay, that makes much more sense. And when it doesn't detect motion, it zooms out. Okay, it makes more sense. But anyways, as I was saying, uh, I can tell that the performance is better because I've actually tried out Open Hexagon on uh, this computer. And I'm talking about the normal application, not the high FPS application. I'm talking about the normal application. And everything worked out perfectly. Uh, even the laggiest levels on high FPS on my laptop, they played perfectly. I'm talking about, like, ideal definition of Face Knockers Turbine. That level loaded perfectly. I, like, it was amazing how that how my computer did not lag over that. And I was fairly impressed to see that it did not lag. But, but yeah, th this is a major revolution. Especially the fact that I got face cam back. And due to new uh, the updates of Bandicam, I'm actually previewing my face cam right now, if you couldn't tell. So I actually could see the face cam on my bottom right corner. Uh, see, so I could see how you guys are viewing me right now. Uh, I can disable the toggling. All I have to do is press a certain shortcut. But 
Actually, I'm going to keep it on for the whole video just in case. Oh, and about the webcam. Uh, it's not 60 frames per second, but I was... I went online and see if there were any uh, webcams that actually did record at 60 frames per second. And it turns out uh, there wasn't any. So this actually is a pretty good webcam. And I think the uh, how famous YouTubers uh, actually manage to get 60 frames per second on their face cams is I don't think they actually use a webcam. I in fact, I actually think they use a video camera like you would like a GoPro or something. And then they would uh, basically take the uh, footage from their camera, upload it to uh, download it to their computer and basically edit the footage like that from there. That uh, that's my theory on how they do it. But basically, but I I don't care if my camera's only like 30 frames per second. I know it's not going to look as appealing in 60 frames per second, but the only thing that really matters is the gameplay. I mean, the, the face cam's, like, cool and sort of, like, especially for horror games, like, you can see how scared you were or, like, how you pissed yourself. Uh, but basically, uh, I would just consider g gameplay the big biggest aspect. Face cam being second, of course. Because face cam, uh, I already explained it. Why do I have to explain myself again? But yeah, uh, I hope you. G but uh, my my friend at school actually recommended uh, a game called Antenna, uh, which is a game on Steam, and I'm actually going to be playing it soon. But just right now, I'm going to have to get. I'm gonna have to wait bef to get Power Director back first before I can uh, start. Uh, before I can start, uh, recording Antenna. Just, I'm not recording Antenna right now because, um, just because of the fact that I don't have Power Director. I don't have my editing program right now. But, that will be coming soon, so hopefully you guys don't have to, uh, so hopefully you guys aren't too scared of me not having my program right now. So, right now I'm just playing this sim stupid obby. Uh, a few hours ago, actually, uh, the games page glitched a lot. And basically what happened was... Um, uh, it basically not, didn't show a whole lot of games. It basically showed like only a certain selection of games. Uh, everybody was like worried about Phantom Forces... But I was talking about, like, all the games in general. But, like, basically saying, like, um, let's see. Sorry, I, my mind just blanked. But basically, I just noticed that there were not a whole lot of games as usual. And I was, and I was, like, going onto the Roblox forums and I was like, yo, people talk to me. What is going on with the, what, what is going on with the games page? And, uh, there's a rumor going, there was a rumor going around saying that they're, impl they're implementing this age filter that basically, um, uh, makes it so that way if you have, uh, if you're, like, um, younger than 13, you can't play certain games on Roblox, and if you want to play all the games, then what you have to do is basically, um, My mind just blanked again. But basically, if I could catch myself to back to where I was. Oh, yeah, the games. So basically, um, yeah, there was, if you're older than 13 years old, then basically uh, you would be able to have access to every single game that there is on Roblox. The reason, and they probably did this so that way they can, um, uh, make it so that way it's a lot more child friendly. Uh, I know I I can see it, but it was so stupid uh, that they could get that they got rid of the games for everyone. Like, at fr but my theory on why they took the games down is I thought that there were hackers on Roblox and they just took a lot of the games off the page, and basically what they did with that is they uh, got rid of most of the games, and then they only put their games on the front page. 
So that way they could get a whole lot of publicity and all of that stuff. Okay, second story. But yeah, but that was my theory. Uh, but of course, there is no confirmed reason why it this has been done. Uh, but hopefully, Roblox will get to uh, back to us with that problem sometime in the in uh like the w next week or two. Okay, so there's supposed to be a teleporter here. Oh, this is the second floor. Oh my god. Okay. So I'm trying to find this stupid teleporter here. But I kind of don't like how the face cam like automatically zooms in. I don't know if that's a bandicam thing or if that's a oh, my webcam thing. Uh, but who cares? Like, basically, I think it's okay. Like, at least it zooms in. A appropriately at least it zooms in appropriately most of the time like i'm fine with it but but if it just goes a little wonky and crazy then i that's probably when i'll start to hate it but so far it hasn't caused me any issues um okay so oh you have got to be kidding me there was no teleporter. Oh, wait. That's because there wasn't a teleporter in the first place. Oh, my God. Ah. I, there you go. I necked myself. I was so stupid. That was probably the dumbest thing ever. But, all right. Now we know our way out now. Okay. That's kind of weird for the end of a house, you, you know? Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that orange with a mustache. That thing is creepy. Okay. Alright. I can't wait to get a... I, I can't... Uh, This has been something that uh, I've been wanting for my channel for months. Months, and I'm talking about months here, uh, literally months. Uh, basically, I've been, we've always been planning to hook up the uh, green screen back there, so that way we could have transparent face cams and all that good stuff. But right now, uh, there's just so much going on. I think it's, I think green, uh, a green screen is the least of our uh, worries for right now. It's probably, like, more of an optional thing, but maybe, like, sometime in the very future, we could probably get it hooked up and then, uh, have transparent face cams. Hooray! Okay. Okay, I can obviously tell that the, my face is being lit by the screen. I would consider that both a good thing and a bad thing. A good thing is, you can tell that I'm legitimately doing gameplay. Bad reason is, it it just doesn't it just doesn't look professional. It doesn't look appealing at all to viewers. Uh, basically, so why do I keep saying basically? Uh, to sum it up, uh, if you don't have very good lighting uh, on your face cam or whatever, uh, basically. Okay, Roblox th was thinking that that's why I switched uh, my uh, recorder to, from F12 because I forgot. I forgot. It also triggers uh, Roblox's uh, video recorder. That's why I changed the hotkey. Uh, I'm going to fix that soon, though, uh, after this video. But, uh... Fuck, I just forgot what I was g talking about. Oh yeah, lighting. Uh, basically, uh, if you don't have very- If you don't have proper lighting, then people will consider your videos very bad because they don't get to see a clear shot of your face. Uh, I mean, you can see a clear shot of my face pretty well, but it's obviously being affected by the screen. 
uh, that I am uh, playing Roblox on. But yeah, to that dude who recommended me Antenna, I will be playing it soon. It's just I've got, I'm just waiting to get my uh. I'm just waiting to get Power Director back before I can start recording it. But once I get Power Director back, uh, I'll start playing Antenna. I'll start playing it. Just, you gotta be patient. Oh god, my face is so red. But you just gotta be patient, you know. Uh, things don't come right away Some of the, most of the time, so you, so you just gotta be patient. But it will come. So don't worry, uh, I, I didn't abandon the idea antenna, I'm just waiting for everything to be, uh, set up good old fashioned again before I can start, uh, a, a normal gameplay again. Dodge the rocks to live? Well, what kind of, what kind of obstacle course is that? That's more like, <gasps> that's more like a minefield to me. Don't step on those pesky... Oh, okay. Now you took it literally. You now took it literally. Wow, nice job. Okay. God, the abuse of the neon hurts my eyes. Especially with this monitor. This monitor is amazing. Like, you actually have to go... To see how amazing that the gameplay is, you have to literally see this for yourself. Because... The colors on uh, this monitor are more saturated on here than an average monitor, which is actually great because I can see uh, a, a broad, a more broad range of colors now. Like I, the contrast between colors is much better. Uh, it's just you guys don't see it, but I do because it's because I have it's because of the monitor I have. But, alright, I've escaped the Xbox. I have an Xbox, and it's right, it's right below my monitor right now. It's just, it's not hooked up to internet right now. It's not hooked up to internet, so I can't, uh, stream Xbox, uh, games on my, uh, Windows 10 yet. But hopefully I will be able to connect this thing to Wi-Fi and hopefully stream games on my computer that will be amazing. But I'll also need to get a wireless adapter because not all computers, uh, especially ones I've we've customly built, come in with sync controllers that basically sync the controller to the desktop. Only Xbox consoles are built in for that, but they have, uh, Microsoft sells this thing so that way, uh, you plug it into a USB and basically you can sync it and play, uh, with your controller on the computer. And that's what I'm planning to get soon. I mean, I would accept that as a birthday present. I, it's pretty cheap. Uh, I would accept that as a birthday present. I would, I would not really care at all. But yeah. This is this has been um a video a normal Roblox video. So yeah, I'm back you guys. I am back as Metrano Ivernin. I hope to see you guys soon. Uh this is Metrano Ivernin signing out. Bye-bye.